Yo, what up, what up, what up? What's good, people? We are back, man. We are back in a space that I wanted to be in for a long time. Just now kickstarting this YouTube channel, and I wanted to do a deep dive into videos like this. So, of course, this channel is going to be focused on reviews, also reactions and stuff, the things that I see on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, the whole nine. A lot of the stuff is going to actually be coming from Facebook. So I have a lot of friends that don't necessarily agree with the things that I post, which is completely cool, man. At the end of the day, I don't know how they feel, but I still look at them as friends. We still cool, man. Anywho, so I seen something online about your girl, Sierra. And this could be an old video that has just resurfaced or whatever. But the video was about Sierra and she was twerking at a gas station, right? And you guys, come on, man. You have seen a lot of videos of Sierra out here shaking that thing in front of the camera, right? <sighs> So I actually shared a post and I said, shaking my head, you can't make this stuff up. <laughs> and somebody hopped up under the uh, up under the post or whatever. And and he said, so since she's married, she can't dance, cut up and or be herself. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to spend some time picking this thing apart a little bit because, you know, I understand who he is and the situation that he's in right now, you know, and I'm just saying he's a married man, you know, and I don't know how their relationship is going and I'm not going to speak on that at all, but I'm just going to say for me, for myself, how I'm moving and what I'm going to encourage more men to do and move like, all right? So I'm gonna say this. Again, I have, I don't really know too much about, I mean, other than what we see in the tabloids and on social media and stuff, nobody really, really knows how Sierra and Russell Wilson's relationship is. I understand that, but I have every freaking right to voice my opinion on this particular topic, situation, or whatever the case may be. So that's what I do, all right? And what I always tell people is keep that same energy, all right? Keep that same energy, bro, from the beginning of this conversation till the end of this conversation. Keep that energy. So I said, I was like, so this is just my belief. This is what I believe. I believe that this generation is creating softer men. I believe that most men, they are afraid to stand on what they believe in. Like they're, they're afraid to speak out or, or say anything. If a girl is behaving in any type of manner that they may feel a, a certain type of way about, most men may not voice their opinion because of the cancel culture, the modern day woman. It's like this. Women and, and girls or whatever, it's like they're free as a bird. They can do whatever, whenever, and no man can say anything about it, all right? you Because for the longest, we've been told to shut the hell up and just go with the flow. Regardless, if we may see that it is completely inappropriate for a wife and a mother to be out here shaking her in front of the camera with the cheeks out with all the rest of her little other friends. I ain't gonna call them thought friends. But uh, but all the rest of her little other friends around, they all sitting there shaking it or whatever. And again, she's doing this in the public eye. All right? Something that's gonna be on social media for the rest of the time for her kids to see, for her grandkids to see. And so it's like this. Again, you are a role model. There are a lot of younger women that look up to you, right? And what we are saying today is if you are a mother and if you are a wife, you don't have to you don't have to be disciplined in any type of way. You don't have any boundaries. You can do what the hell you want to do instead of moving in a different type of light. I feel like this, once you get married, 
once you, you know, you have children, there is a certain way that you need to move. I understand that nobody is perfect. I do understand that we all make mistakes. And I also believe that we as human adults need to try to fix or correct any of those mistakes moving forward. And you cannot sit here and honestly tell me that it's completely okay for a mother or a wife to be out here shaking her ass in front of the camera. It's completely okay. And again, this is what we're teaching to the younger generation. The women in training to be wives, to be mothers of the next generation. It's okay. Regardless if you're married, regardless if you have a husband at home, you got kids at home. And I'm pretty sure I would hope that these type of things you would not be doing in the front of your children. Keep in mind, children are on the freaking internet more today than they've been ever understand that we're not perfect but moving forward i do believe that we need to we need to move in a certain light that's not just women but men as well how many times have you heard a man that's been married say listen young man hey you're married now you have a wife you have a children there's a certain way that you have to move they've been telling the men this for generations from generation to generation we've been telling men hey chill calm down don't say that allow her no, this is not okay. What did I say at the beginning of this video? Keep that same energy. Men and women, you should both be moving in a different light. Once you get married, once you settle down, you have children, you got a significant other at home. You should not do anything or try not to do anything that's going to embarrass that other person. There are certain boundaries that you should not cross. And that's just me. That's just me, man. You guys, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments when I tell you People are going ham about this particular topic. I'm going to touch on a lot of different things today. I know that I'm going to have a lot of people that's going to disagree with this. Hey, it is what it is, man. Leave all your smoke down in the comments. I have no problem with addressing any issue that I talk about. All right. Anyway, you guys be blessed. Y'all be beautiful. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Blueberry, burberry, button up. Ten skin, mixed race, buttercup. Canada weather got a bundle up. I'm trying to work. She hit my phone. She wanna. Whoa. Too bad was you know they wrote.